Hey guys and welcome back to the morning. I am Stijo and this is the Holy Slit. Um, we last episode we found out that we made a big fucking boo boo with these troughs. What a fucking idiot. <laughs> but you know, that's just me. And our merchants away for sleep. Ah, he's back. Ah, maybe he's waiting for something to eat. It's fine. We've got um, our drinks coming back up. Our food's not doing too well, but that's only because we've had no. I, I say not doing too well. We've only we've lost like 200 food or something over the winter, and that's only because we had no animals. Oh, there comes the army, and that's a dead clay golem with an arm or a leg. It's been ripped off, apparently. Ah, so these guys are coming down now. Pick stuff up. I don't know if they're g gathering stone to be put into slivers or what. I know, apparently you get more stuff out of stone than you do out of dirt, so let's hope that we get some decent stuff. I mean, we've got a lot of stone. <laughs> like, just look at this area down here. We have a crap ton of stone. Well, box it anyway. And it's ugly, so I've got no issue using all of that. We'll make stuff out of basalt if we need to. I'm not going to use sandstone either, that's ugly. Make stuff out of basalt. Hopefully we can get a bit deeper and get some marble, because I really like marble. Uh, lapis, not so much. I don't like the horrible blue. It's like one of those really bright blues. Not a big fan of that. But if we get marble, then we can start making some cool constructions. Even some granite. If we get granite, I can, like, I can replace all the walls with granite and make everything look really castle-y. Which should be pretty cool. Make a monument to the uh, bazillion fallen heroes that we've had. Haha, <laughs> no name gnome. I remember those guys. Look at them all. 49 dead. Christ, that's a lot of dead people. I should make like skulls on sticks all the way around the place. <laughs> That'd be brutal as hell. We'll do some crazy stuff as soon as I can get some granite because I don't want to make a castle out of box it's just ugly. Make some cool stuff though. I think about a drawbridge but uh, drawbridges are a bit crap. The only way that I'd be able to make a drawbridge is if I had um, mechanical walls in a line that just dropped and then water flowing into it so I could have like a moat and then when the mechanical draw walls dropped water flew into it and then when the mechanical walls went back up the water just went and splashed out the way that'd be kinda cool but I don't want to completely block off my um, my fort because that just causes issues that I don't want to deal with um, I'll probably leave like a little side door <laughs> a wee side door open for the, the battles and things while having a big grand entrance. That'd be cool. A wee side bridge. Do, 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 do. What are you making? Out of copper? Oh, you're making that final copper pickaxe, hand axe that didn't actually need making. There's two copper hand axes there. And it's still wanting to make. Oh, no, it's not. Yes, it is. Oh, no, it's not. No, it's not. I mean, that's fine. Well, sorted. There can be more people with copper hand axes. As long as it doesn't keep flicking over and saying that it needs more copper. It needs a haft? What? If you're just going to keep wasting copper on hand axes, I'm going to have to cancel that order. Weapon Smith. Ah, no, nope, looks like it's no longer making any. That's good. Is it? Hmm. That's not. That's definitely not.
I just don't want to waste and stuff. Let's see what he makes out of this piece of stone. And... Oh, Malachite. Silver tin, Malachite, Malachite. That's fine. Uh, it's the, I was like, is he not wearing a chest plate? But it's not, it's just a green off of the, the strawberry. No, 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 And then he goes and gets a sandwich. <laughs> they eat fruit, meat, bread. Perfect. Nice, uh, nice varied diet. That's good for them. Good for my little gnomes. How's your skill coming along, Cracker? Skills. Tinkering, 109. Good man. Gonna be as good as Blaine was, your predecessor. Oh, that was actually probably why we didn't have any gnomes, because we lost all of our stock of animals, dropping our kingdom worth sufficiently. Makes sense. People are coming down here now. Oh, he's grabbing the uh, the stone. I don't know why he came to this. Ah, obviously because he was right above it when he accepted the job. God, the path needs something. Oh, enemies at the gates. Five goblins, one down. Two down. Three down. That, that one's just losing body parts and all sorts. That's it. Five down. Uh, build furniture door. Box out door. Right there. Thank you. They died quick. How's a bandage situation? 58. We lost six bandages there. Is this one full? Yep, 96. Perfect. Wow. A lot of tailors are going to be so happy. <laughs> They've got like, literally no work to do. Uh, let's see. Um, how many ogre panels have we got? 39. So, 39 divided by 4 is... 36 is 9. So we can make nine ogre leather outfits, eh? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Perfect. That's good. That means that we can get at least nine people dressed in ogre leather. Can I just make my militia uniform wear anything for just now? There's no bronze for them to wear as a breastplate, so they won't, uh, no copper rather, so they won't pick that up and slow themselves down. But once the, uh, the ogre leather stuff's been made, they'll go and grab that. Yeah, I know that one wasn't going to last very long. So I'm sure my tailors do leather working as well. Professions. Yeah, they do leather working bone craftsmen. So when they're not doing the... Uh, when they've run out of bandages to make, they can go and make the, uh, the leather stuff. How's my animals doing? My animals are doing good. It's good to see. Like 19. Perfect. It'll take a while to repopulate them, of course, but uh, it'll get done eventually. Well, I'm quite happy with this area, um, not digging down any deeper. Like I said, I want to wait until we're at steel because I'm no longer going to use the little cancel job cheat. I'm not going to do this anymore. Ah. Um, 
I know there's a big area here, and there's one here, that's why we stopped mining out that copper. Um, I'm not going to use it anymore because that's a bit cheaty, and yeah. If there was something in game to do it, I would use that, sure, because that's like a mechanic. But there's not right now, so I'm not going to cheat. Because I'm, I'm, I'm beyond cheap. Right, so how is... Oh, fuck. Sorry guys, I just smacked my mic. Uh, fuck my back, man. It's because I'm not sitting right, because I'm not sitting properly in my chair. I'll, uh, I'll swap my mic between episodes so that I can sit properly in my chair and stop breaking my own back. Uh, that should do me. Uh, yeah, you should, should be able to hear me alright. Never mind, don't need to sort it between episodes, you can do it now. Uh, let's see how the guys' kills are going. PG was winning. He's now got seven kills. Spastica has two. And Odin Prime has four. Oh, Odin Prime's catching up. He did kill the beetle as well. How's your skills looking? 34, 32. Spastica, 34, 33. PJ, 34, 33. Huh? So Odin Prime's actually lacking on the skills, but he's making up with it with some kills. Although PJ is absolutely wrecking right now with his kills. How's your tinkering doing? It's getting there. I don't want to lose a tinkerer because it takes a while to get them up to speed. Mother f Yeah, it takes them a little while to get them up to speed on their tinkering. I mean, and he's at 111 now. And the sooner I can get flintlock pistols, the better, because it means I'll lose less actual militia. Yeah, you bring that clay golem body for no reason. It just gets to sit in here until it decays. How's our food looking? 6, 7, 8, that's fine. Our drink's not looking too good, but that's also fine. As soon as we get the uh, the axe back up and running, we'll be getting a lot of uh, milk again. So we good. Yeah, I think that's all our bandages back. He's making thread for the ogre leather, I'm guessing. Yeah. String and pattern. Oh, is that a... Uh, a bronze hammer? Yeah, it is. Perfect. So that means we're getting a bronze hammer. That means there'll be another copper hammer for one of my militia to use. It's brilliant, so I'm te technically I am uh, taking up my army, but also I'm taking up my militia at the same time. I'm waiting to see who grabs us to see if... Uh... Oh wow! That is the last uh, bronze hammer that he's made as well. That's fantastic. And he's sleeping. Hopefully that's been reserved for him because I don't want some scrub lord taking it. Oh, no mind, some scrub lord has taken it. It was the uh, whoever it was that was running around with the sword. So as soon as he's awake, I'll, uh, I'll get my militia to drop everything. Ah, but that also means that the armorer can make me a bronze armor plate, which I can then make loads of bronze armor with. Yay! So that's good. So you make me a bronze armor plate, um, then I can. Yes, he's got the bronze armor. He's got the bronze bars there. It takes eight bronze bars to make a freaking chest plate. That's crazy. There's two Ogalila cuirasses there. Curious. I need to check at the end of this episode how that's actually pronounced. And speaking of the end of the episode, it smacks you right in the face. Alright guys, so as always, thanks a lot for watching and hopefully I'll see you next time. Bye bye.